Hello everybody and welcome back. We've been off for a day because we were busy. We were passing out food at some of the schools and we were helping out. So we are back with story time today. And Gizmo even brought one of his friends, the leopard, for story time today. Yeah, leopard's here. So as we said at our last story time, we're going to be reading about clownfish today. And for those of you who saw the movie Finding Nemo, he is a clownfish. So we are going to get started. I hope you like the story about manatees. Clownfish are small fish. They are smaller than your hand. Clownfish live in warm parts of the ocean, and they live near the ocean floor. Have you seen a clownfish, Gizmo? Oh, there is one. A clownfish have a tail, and they move their tail back and forth. When we saw the manatee's tail was moving this way, but the clownfish moved side to side. Clownfish have rounded fins, and clownfish use their bottom fins to steer. Wow, Gizmo is very interested in this clownfish. Yeah, how about it? Most clownfish are orange with three white stripes, and most clownfish have a black tip on their fins and on their tail. See if you can see the black. See that? Gizmo, do you see it? Oh yeah. You see it, right buddy? Clownfish have gills right off of their face and they use those gills to breathe. Clownfish have scales that cover their skin. See the gills right up there? Yes. Clownfish live with sea anemones. Sea anemones have long tentacles. Check it out. Yeah. See this? Sea leopard? The tentacles of a sea anemone sting other animals, but they do not hurt the clownfish because clownfish have slime on their bodies and this slime protects them from the sea anemones. That's excellent covering. See, buddy? Yeah. I'll protect you. Clownfish and the sea anemone help each other. Bigger fish that try to eat clownfish, but the sea anemone hides them like camouflage from the other fish. See, buddy? Yeah. Gizmo loves books. Clownfish chase away other fish that want to eat the sea anemones. Sea anemones use their tentacles to catch fish for food. They're like good friends. Like me and you, Giz. See? Clownfish eat the leftovers that keep sea anemones clean. Clownfish never go far away from the sea anemone. They are good friends and they help each other out deep in the ocean floor. Wow, so that was Oceans Alive, learning about clownfish. So we've read two stories about animals this week. Tomorrow we're going to read a funny story, so stay tuned. What do you think, Gizmo? What do you think, Leopard? So I hope everyone stays safe, get outside and get some exercise, listen to our stories and check back tomorrow. If you have a recommendation, of a story that you would like Gizmo and I to read, feel free to send it to me. You can email it at drmatthewxjoseph at gmail.com or you can tweet it at me at matthewxjoseph. Have a great day, Gizmo. Oh, we'll see everybody later.